Maligayang Pasko po, mga kababayan. Thank you so much for sharing your Christmas Eve with us on Kababayan Today, your premier resource for anything and everything Filipino and Filipino-American. My name is Janelle Sawyer, Kababayan in Los Angeles, and like I mentioned earlier, it is Christmas Eve. Merry Christmas to everyone. I know that you have many choices of things to do on Christmas Eve, but I really take it as a gift from you to us that you're choosing to watch Kababayan today, right this minute. And don't worry, we're going to make it worth your while because we have prepared a very special Christmas Eve show for you, complete with Christmas blessings, of course, Christmas prayer, and of course, music. We will not forget about music. In fact, we will start with that. Here is the Immaculate Heart of Mary Children's Choir. you before on the show talking about Immaculate Heart of Mary Church, Immaculate uh -huh. Heart of Mary Parish. You've just been making a lot of noise, doing a lot for the community, winning a lot of awards, getting a lot of recognition. For the people that live in other areas of Southern California, or even in Hawaii, um, because we're syndicated there, what is Immaculate Heart of Mary Parish? Well, it's a very um, active, engaging church. Uh, it's very hospitable. I mean, people okay. come here, yeah, they're very, very diverse. We come from different cultures. We have, of course, uh, a lot of our Filipino brothers and sisters come to this church, and a lot of uh, Hispanic uh, immigrants from Mexico, El Salvador, Guatemala, uh, and other Latin American countries are here. So it's, a, it's, it's really a very joyful church also. You know, it's just, I mean, I've been here for 12 years, and, and I have so many difficult experiences of being a pastor of this church and the people are so lovely and great to, to work with. Yeah, that's what they say, that the parish reflects the demeanor, the, the um, personality of the pastor or mm -hmm. what's it like to have um, Father Rodel as a parish priest here at Immaculate Heart of Mary. With, with, with him as our pastor, as very energetic pastor, <laughs> So you really have to be energetic too. You really have to be on the go as well like him. Yeah. That's why maybe it, it just contagious. What he's doing is so contagious to all of us. That's why we also give our best because he's giving his best as well. And with that best comes, uh, you know, being besting competitions for the choir, which we will talk about more later, but also a lot of activities. You, you talk about being engaged and engaging. A lot of activities during Christmas. What's Christmas like at Immaculate Heart of Mary Parish? Well, it's, it's the most enjoyable time of the year. It's the most exciting time of the year. We bring the Filipino Christmas here in Hollywood. <laughs> very <laughs> festive. What are some of those very, activities? very festive. Yeah. We have Simbangabi. Um, oh, and you're one of the churches that offers Simbangabi in the morning. In the morning. Just like what we do in the Philippines, in right? In the morning. What mm -hmm. time? At five in the morning. Okay. And you would see this church packed. Packed. Oh, in yeah. the cold. At four thirty, even if it's raining outside, this is a packed church. Right. Right. Yes, and the, you have to come early to come to to get a seat. By the way, <laughs> <laughs> there are a lot of people who comes from different places who also go to this church. Mm -hmm. uh, as far as yeah. San Fernando Valley, uh -huh. Glendale, they would they would celebrate. Christmas here at Simbangabi. Even at oh. five, in the five in the morning. Five in the morning. They say that Christmas is also the busiest for priests. Yeah, it is the busiest, <laughs> of course. I mean, waking up for nine days, and I, I know, I enjoy it. And if my people are waking up early, you gotta be also doing a lot of sacrifice. 
But you're not the, but you're not just saying the mass, you're also organizing a lot yeah. of these activities. Uh -huh. Aside from Simbangabi, what else do you have? Well, you have concerts? Yes, we, we're having a we concert. Do have, we do have concerts, a lot of performances with the school and the church. Mm -hmm. The Hispanic community, they have their Guadalupe. We just finished our Guadalupe. Right. Mm -hmm. um, different Christmas concerts. Uh, on the December 20, 20th, we have a Christmas uh, annual Christmas concert here at church, too. Mm -hmm. Right. And our Hispanic communities are having posadas. Mm -hmm. Posadas, night, yeah. yeah. So you celebrate everything. So, so it's a celebratory parish. <laughs> yes, and after the Simbangabi Masses, uh, uh, we have, uh, after it's mass, we have uh, breakfast, wow. of, uh, typical Filipino breakfast, tutu bongbong, uh, kalamay, uh, a lot of uh, lugao. lugao and sopas. sopas. <laughs> I like that. So everyone coming together to celebrate and share blessings. Yeah, and it's free. Everyone is invited. And, right. and I know every, every day it builds up, the joy builds up, you know, and then and people really enjoy each other. It, it's, <laughs> I, think, I, think, I think people look forward to this because it's kind of like a recollection, attending a retreat. I right. know, yes. And it's in like fact, we invite priests from the Philippines who are the best preachers okay. in the Philippines. And our, our preachers, you know, the priests who come here, uh, you know, have been so dynamic. And people just, you know, at 5 o'clock, they're all awake and, and, and enjoying the, the, the message of the priest. Speaking huh? of enjoying, speaking of the message, speaking of the blessings, that all of that, that's what we're celebrating tonight, Christmas Eve on Kababayan Day here at Immaculate Heart of Mary uh, Church. When we talk about Immaculate Heart of Mary Church and Parish, yeah. one of the most notable things about this parish, aside from the dynamic yeah. uh, parish priest, is of course the choir. And we've heard them sing, we're going to hear more of their songs today on the show. And when we return, we're going to talk specifically to Pete, you are the <laughs> choir director yeah. of, of, of that children's choir. Who's, uh, they've won many awards, they've had mm -hmm. many experiences not just all over the U.S., but also all over the world, and some plans, not yet. <laughs> plans for them to sing in Europe. Okay, yeah. we'll talk more about that, sharing blessings, sharing music today on our program. We'll be right back. Don't go away. Don't